James Gallup with Envirotech Heating and Cooling. We've got our work cut out for us today. We're going to be removing a, about a 50, 60 year old furnace and installing a new high efficiency furnace. The furnace that we're removing is a gravity furnace, so it has no blower motor, but it is a big monster. So we've got our work cut out for us. We're going to head to the job site and uh, get rolling on it. Envirotech Heating and Cooling. Over the next couple days, we're going to be removing this old gravity furnace and installing a forced air furnace. In case you're wondering what a gravity furnace is, basically there's no blower motor in this furnace to blow the air upstairs. It uses these pipes that are wrapped in asbestos and carries the duct up with gravity. We have a professional asbestos abatement company coming in and they're going to remove this asbestos for us. Uh, the new furnace that we're going to install is going to be 95.5% efficient. This furnace is probably operating at about 40% efficient, uh, which means for every dollar of gas, the furnace is actually using 40 cents to heat the house and the other 60 cents is actually wasted. So our asbestos abatement company just showed up. We're going to let them get to work and we'll be back with As you can see, we have the old gravity furnace tore out now. Um, all of the ductwork in the house is removed. The asbestos company did a really nice job of keeping the basement clean. We we're happy about that. We have our new furnace set now with a new plenum is what we call the the area right above the furnace that the, for the ductwork. Then we've started running our trunk line takeoffs. Um, we've also started on our cold air return ducts. So the furnace is set now. The old gravity furnace is out of the way and we're ready to do our ductwork installation. Uh, after that it's going to be just a matter of uh, the standard flue piping and electrical and gas line. So we're going to... Alright, at Envirotech Heating and Cooling we are an environmentally friendly company. One thing we can do to help the environment is not just dispose of our old equipment, furnaces, air conditioners, just throwing them in landfills is not a good idea. So we work with a, a scrap metal uh, company that comes out to our job sites and picks up the old equipment. This is the old furnace that we took out of the basement. Um, it's going to be recycled and turned into who knows what, but uh, someday this, this, uh, this old furnace can be uh, reused and turned into something valuable. Okay, we've now completed the installation of the new furnace. Um, as you can see, the new furnace takes up a lot less space than that old gravity furnace. Also, this furnace is rated at 95.5% efficiency. So for every dollar of gas, 95.5 cents stays in the house and the other 4.5 cents is sent outside. Remember, the old furnace was running probably, we're saying 40 to 50% efficiency. Um, the old furnace also took up probably another 3 or 4 feet. Um, we had to replace all of the ductwork in the house down, down below. We tried to keep all the ductwork up as high as we possibly could um, so people wouldn't hit their heads on it. So as, as you can tell, uh, we're all done. The asbestos is out of here. The house is now ready to uh, enjoy its new furnace.